everyone. Um, if you don't know me, if you've subscribed recently, my name is Maggie Reed. I've run this channel Maggie the Mommy. It was Maggie Reed before, but there was a whole big shebang and I changed names and... <sighs> I wanted to come on and update you guys about the last month that I've taken off. I took it off very unexpectedly. I just stopped posting videos one day and it's been about a month now, so I wanted to come back and just kind of update you guys <laughs> on what's been going on, because there's a lot to update, to update you guys on how I've been feeling, things that have been going on in my life, what my plans are for this channel. I tried to do this in like a live update a few, well, about a month ago, about a week before I stopped posting videos, and I don't know why. I decided to do it live, because I thought, oh, that's gonna be super easy for me. And the second I hit live, I felt all this pressure because it was live to just say, oh my god, everything's fine, it's gonna be okay, I'm gonna just do it and it's gonna be fine. Um, and the thing was, it wasn't fine. And I shouldn't have said it was fine, and I shouldn't have said that I'm just gonna keep doing everything how it's gonna be doing, and I'm just gonna do everything because that's okay. Because I can't. I just, I can't right now. And if this last month has taught me anything, it's that I can't do everything. The reason I initially took off the time was because I just couldn't find the time to make videos. And I used to laugh at people who used to make, use that as an excuse. And I would have been like, oh, well I do this and this and this and this and this, and I can still make videos, so you can. And I just, I couldn't get the inspiration. I was overrun and overwhelmed. I was suffering from depression and anxiety. I was dealing with a lot of people behind the scenes for my YouTube channel who were just treating me like trash. And it was very difficult for me. I was trying to balance it all and I just couldn't one day. One day I was just like, you know what, I can't do today's video. And I I would love to lie to you guys and say, oh, I felt bad. That It felt so nice not posting that video. Not having to deal with these angry people anymore. Just being able to forget it all. Forget the anxiety about my channel. Forgetting the time and effort that needed to be put into it. Forgetting all of my huge to-do list for this channel. Forgetting the angry people behind the scenes forgetting all of the little things that I had to do to make this work. It was so nice just to forget all that. And I have to say for the first week I got, just got caught up in how nice it felt. And then after a while I started realizing, you know what, look how clean my house is. Look how much attention my children get when I'm not focusing on YouTube. And that's when I really d debated just leaving my channel as was and just quitting. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, the background is not gonna be silent of this video. I usually try to, every other video up until now, I've tried to have like perfect background and perfect lighting and perfect noise and all this stuff. My kid's playing in the living room. My other one's trying to take a nap, but is kicking the wall like she always does. My cat's running around destroying everything because he's been so bad with his behavior lately. So this video isn't gonna be noise free. I'm not perfect. This month has been a huge wake up call for me that I'm not perfect in real life. I'm far from it and I need to stop trying to portray that on this channel because nobody's perfect. But this last month, my kids have been insane. My seven month old has decided that he doesn't want to fall asleep anymore unless someone holds him. So I have spent so much time holding him for him to go to sleep. I've had so little free time. My almost two year old has the flu. She's potty training and she is, she's really taken on these terrible twos. Let me tell you that. She has been the worst behavior wise. It's been something we've really been working on. She, I found out that she is, doesn't want to be like the other kids and listen and sit down next to me when we're out in public settings or in her activities that she has this fall. She wants to not listen to anybody and run and climb and scream and do everything that she's not supposed to. So I am exhausted and I am overrun and I am depressed and I am trying to get over everything in my life. Some of you guys were wondering about Lane's job. My husband. My husband is Lane if you don't know. Uh, my husband Lane, he was laid off right before we had, I shouldn't say right before, a couple months before we had our son, Everett. Um, and he's been really struggling to find a job in our like recession job market right now. Um, and he ended up finding a great job that's something he really wants to do. It's not the same career path as he was on before. He's decided to completely switch careers, which I 100% support him in. Um, but this new job is taking him away from home a lot. He will be working out in camps on rotation. I'm officially an oil field wife. Um, so I'm gonna be spending a lot of time here by myself 24-7 with kids. I wouldn't say it's overwhelming, but it's just 
they need a lot of my attention. That's just how kids are. Uh, and without somebody to switch off with, I'm going to be having a really hard time filming videos without my kids in them, without my kids running around, without noise in the background. So this is going to be how my channel looks now because I just, there's no possible way to fit it in to make it all work. Lane helped me so much with my channel while he was home. He watched the kids while I filmed, he watched the kids while I edited. I pretty much could do whatever I wanted in regards to my channel whatever time of day that I could. Um, and now that he's working, I'm having to just fit things in wherever the heck I can find them and it's becoming a lot more difficult. I know this video is gonna be super rambly, I just, I wanted to talk to you guys and I wanted to just turn on the camera and talk and just tell you guys about how I've been feeling and what's going on in my life and where this channel is going and if you're not okay with this video then just turn it off and wait for the next one because they're definitely and I'm not center because um, there definitely will be more videos to this channel definitely not as plentiful as they were before uh, I think I'm gonna cut it back to two videos a week I hope all of you guys are okay with that uh, but there's just no way I can possibly produce three high quality videos a week. It's just not gonna happen right now. I'm gonna cut it back to two videos a week, sometimes one. I'm going to be completely getting rid of my schedule, um, which is another change I hope you guys are okay with. It's so much pressure trying to make sure that these videos are up one after another. So I'm gonna be uploading two videos a week. Those videos might be uploaded Saturday and Sunday. Those videos might be uploaded Monday and Thursday. They might be uploaded Tuesday, Wednesday. It's whenever I can get them up whenever I feel like they're ready for you guys. So I hope you guys are okay with that change. I know a lot of you guys have been wondering, I've gotten a lot of messages saying, are you okay? Like you were talking in your update about how you're really depressed and you're having a really hard time recovering from this miscarriage. And I thank all of you who checked on me <laughs> and were so sweet. And in reality, I've had a really rough time. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I've been having a really hard time recovering from my last miscarriage, mentally, not physically, because um, it was a very early miscarriage, but just mentally, because um, for the longest time we thought we weren't going to have another baby right away, and it was like, oh my god, like, I don't know. It was just really hard on my soul. I wanted to mention the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. No, I have not forgotten it. I had a really bad run-in with a giveaway lately and it's just made me really nervous to upload it, to move forward with it, um, just because I had a situation where I was like blackmailed and sla slandered, and I just, I don't wanna deal with that again. I don't, I, I hope, I never, 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 it was the worst situation that I've ever run in with a giveaway winner. It's the worst situation that I've ever heard anyone else run into with a giveaway winner. Um, so I personally never want to have to go through that again. I do still plan on doing the thousand subscriber giveaway because I promised you guys that. I'm still working on the last few um, details for that and the last few participants for that giveaway. So that should be up soon. So I will be doing that giveaway, but I don't see myself doing any more giveaways in the near future. Just because that situation with the giveaway and how everything turned out just completely turned my stomach. Um, and I'm just so done with giveaways after this unless it's something where like I'm partnering with a company and the company's gonna be like I'll be running the giveaway but the company will be dealing with um, the distribution of the prizes and everything else um, that will be my only situation where I'll be doing a giveaway as in like me giving things to you just me I don't see myself doing that in a long time and I know it's like one bad apple spill is a whole bunch and it sucks but it's just it's been really rough to recap um, I have been doing pretty crappy but I'm I feel like I'm on the mend now my husband has started a new job I've been trying to figure out everything in my life I've realized that I can't be perfect and that I can't do everything and that's just the way it is I will now be uploading two times a week instead of three times a week and it will not be on a schedule um, and I think that is everything so oh and as for those of you who follow follow the vlog channel vlogs will be resuming pretty soon here I might actually have a vlog up on that channel before I upload on this channel, so make sure you go check it out, because I am, I'm really excited to be vlogging again, especially for the holidays, for Audrey's birthday. I'm super excited. So if there's any new videos, new content that you guys would like to see, whether it be a review, whether it be a comparison video, uh, whether it be cloth diapering related, potty training related, um, winter accessories, um, if you want to see like how how my routine is and how it's like trying to do things 
mostly by myself with my husband going to be working away. Um, if you want to see any of that, just leave a comment down below because I am completely open to creative ideas right now. Like I have a lot of them, but I'd, I'd like to hear some more. Please let me know down in the comments down below. Um, I'm so happy to be back and I hope you guys are excited to see me back as well. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.